Hi, I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats at Hot Docs in downtown Toronto. I'm here with Marco Wiesel Gelby, one of the producers of On the Bright Side. How does it feel to have the film here at Hot Docs? Well, this is just a dream. Also because this is a film that has been done against everybody and everyone. I met the producers and filmmakers when they came back from the shooting and uh, they were in a huge debt and we work out a strategy, you know, to raise the money and to make the film. And actually we have been lucky enough to make the most successful crowdfunding ever done in Europe for on a documentary that gave us something like 100,000 euros. And from that moment on, we develop a strategy to bring the film to the attention of the people. And uh, actually, we are very happy because this is a film that is not produced for someone, but is a produced for a community that want to tell some story and want this story to be represented. Absolutely. And what was it about this story that was really important to you to tell, for you to get involved in it, uh, the story about uh, staging a wedding for immigration purposes? Well, you know, <clears throat> I am very sensible to immigration problem, but all the films I have seen so far are films that <clears throat> are very sad, and when you, when you get out for the theater, you feel guilty and you don't want to hear any more about that. What makes this film completely different is that, first of all, is a civilian disobedient act, something that the producers has made try to change something. And when the people go and see the film, in somehow they get out of the theater to say, okay, there's something we can do. We, there, uh, there is a po sort of political engagement that you can, where you can say the law as it is doesn't work. Uh, we want to change, we want to do something. That positive attitude, I think, is uh, what makes this film different from all the other I have seen. And what can we do uh, to help? What can we do to help the situation? Well, to try to be a little bit less egoist. I think that what the Western society is doing is to think that uh, to keep everything for ourselves uh, um, is the right way to do. And this is not, because this is creating a huge war between us and the rest of the world. And we need to do something about that. I'm positive. And where's the best place for us to find out more information on the film online? Well, we have a wonderful online uh, website where you can find all the, inf all the information that is uh, on the bright side, uh, or uh, Io sto con la sposa in Italian, if you want. And there is all the information of the film, uh, press release and uh, news and whatever. And, you know, what, in my opinion, what makes this film special is that one of the directors have a very wonderful blog on the internet uh, that uh, <clears throat> tell about the migration stories uh, that is called Fortes Europe. Uh, and if you go there, you can get a lot of information, of first-hand information on migration that could help a lot. Well, thank you so much. Congrats on your success here at Hot Dogs and many other festivals, including Venice, and best of luck with the project. Thank you very much. And I, let me say that it is a huge emotion to be here once more time in Toronto with this film because you feel uh, you, you feel that is you can get something out of it. Uh, it's uh, it's a community of people that support documentary, love documentary, and to see the the old city that go and to the screening is just wonderful. Thank you. We're happy to have you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats at Hot Docs in Toronto. <laughs>